Hi, I just wanted to make a quick little thought on the app on Kyle Larson. I believe that what he got is what he deserves. And the thing is, is that it's not like he's from another country. You know exactly what that word means here. You know that you're never supposed to say that, well, unless you're black, but you probably shouldn't be saying it in the first place. Just my opinion. You can't... To all those people that are just defending him on this, you have no stance to defend him on. Because he knows he did wrong. He knows he did it. And the man made a mistake... In this video, to me, it seemed kind of half-assed. Half but, uh... Yeah, no, he got what he deserved. And, like... To me, it's not that he said it. I, I need to word this carefully. It's not that he said it. It's more like he did an action that is detrimental to stock car racing. Because we've been trying to shake this racist stereotype for years. What do you think the Drive for Diversity program is? We've been trying to shake this crap for years. And he just set us back a decade. In the public eye. So, excuse me for being mad. Because this guy's fucking stupid. And did something fucking stupid. And I feel for all the little kids because he was like a child fan favorite. I've seen several things on Twitter today. Like, my daughter needs a new favorite driver. Who should she vote for? My son, he was a Larson fan. Who should he root for now? I'm seeing a lot of Bowman. A lot of Bowman, a lot of Blaney. Which is good for those fan bases. But if I... I'm a Ryan Planey fan. If he said that shit, I'd be jumping off the bandwagon like it was that. I can actually snap. What am I doing? Um, but, yeah. It's kind of bullshit that people think that this is okay. <laughs> I can't even imagine. Do I think he's done? It's a high probability that he's done. Because I don't think any race team wants the headline, NASCAR team hires racist. It's probably going to be Rick Ware, to be honest. Because it's Rick Ware. Um, but yeah. It's just upsetting. It's really upsetting. Because there's stupid stereotype. I can't even... I'm lost for words. Now you have Marcus Stroman wanting to fight the fucker. Well, Marcus Stroman, you're no angel. Yeah, I remember the whole dog cutting ears thing. Not a good look for you either. Not racism, but dog abuse. But my god. This is just one giant clusterfuck. The last couple weeks have sucked. I'm not even talking about uh, the Toyota Corolla virus. Uh, like last week, tonsils swole up so badly that I could only eat soup and hot tea. Right now I'm dealing with, I don't know, like an ear infection. What am I, Carl fucking Weezer? Can't stay healthy? Made out of glass ass? I'm... Maybe it's stress. Without sports, I feel like I'm dead inside. So, yeah. So, I got to go to work now at Target. So, I hope you all have a good day. And remember, guys, never say the N-word. Don't be stupid. Don't be fucking stupid.